Hi guys, it's Cinnamon here and I'm here with Libby. Hey. And we're just gonna show you how to use the fold over elastic with the new swimsuit pattern. So we have all the pieces sitting here on our sewing table cut out to make another swimsuit and each piece of fold over elastic is cut to the right measurement from the pattern. So now we're gonna move over to the sewing machine and we're gonna show you how we sew the fold over elastic. All right, here we have the front of the bathing suit. This is the top right here. This is the fold over elastic. And you can kind of see, I'm gonna hold it up. It's creased right down the center so that it will fold in half like this. So what you're gonna do is set your front of your bathing suit right on there, up halfway to the fold, and then fold this part over. So it's on the front and it's on the back, like that, and you're gonna feed it through your sewing machine, doing your zigzag stitch right up towards the, the open end. Now you can pause while you're doing it, make sure that your fabric is inside and you can pull on the elastic a little bit, but don't stretch your swimsuit fabric and you just keep sewing. And just stop and check and make sure that it's still inside. And you'll have a little bit of overhang as you pull the elastic past the end of the top of the bathing suit. Okay, so there we have kind of zigzagged across and you can see it on the back side as well. So now we're gonna do the same thing. The back piece that looks like this and this slanted edge that goes down right here is where you're gonna put these small pieces and you're gonna do it the same way. So you lay it in there right up to the halfway point and you fold your elastic over. You can pin it uh, if it'll help you to hold it. Now the straps are gonna, you're gonna line up the end of the strap with right here down at the end of the arm, like this. And then you're gonna have a gap up here where it's gonna go over the shoulder and then the back piece is gonna line up at the other end, like this. So you'll have the space in the center. And you're gonna zigzag, once you have it folded, you're gonna zigzag all the way even over this part, just be careful not to pull on it. Just let it sew it closed and then over the front part. Okay, now we have both fronts, both of the straps done. And now Libby's gonna sit down and she's gonna show you uh, how to sew the side seams and the back seam of the bathing suit. To do that, we're gonna switch our stitch to a stretch stitch. And um, that's kind of like a zigzag, but it's not quite as wide as a zigzag. It kind of zigzags, but downward in a straight motion so that when the bathing suit gets pulled like this, uh, the threads don't break. If you use a straight stitch and the bathing suit gets pulled on or stretched like this, the threads will break and then your seam will open. So we've switched it to a stretch stitch, and now Libby's gonna sit down and do the side seams. Okay, first we're gonna set this right under the foot like this. Make sure you're lined up at your quarter inch seam allowance and put the foot down. And then you're gonna stretch stitch right down the side seam. Okay, we'll pull this pin out just for when you get started. Okay, you got it? Yep. Yeah. Okay. And we've slid down the speed here 
down to a little bit slower so it goes nice and slow for you. Er. cut the thread and we're gonna sew here's her side seam and now we're gonna do the other side so here you can see how when I pull it the seams or the threads don't break so that's the point of a stretch stitch so here are the side seams and that one and that one. So yeah. Okay, now we're gonna sew the elastic on this leg opening, which is right here. Right there. It'll go around this way. And then once you do that, you'll fold it over this way and sew the back seam and down here. Okay, so now we're gonna sew the back seam. I'll just pull this pin out. Okay, so we have it here, and then we're just gonna put it like this, so you can see basically this is the inside out, and we're just gonna sew this seam. So the seam has been sewn, and so now I'm just gonna trim the threads. And so excited, because this is going to look amazing. Okay, so when we, have it in, or when we turn it right side out, here's what it looks like. And it looks very really cool. Okay, so here it is, and I'm really excited to try it on Kanani. And I just can't believe that this is done because I really, really wanted to have a bathing suit, and now I do. Well, I mean, for my doll. Yeah, so, yeah, yay. Oh my gosh. Oh, she looks so cute. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, that is just adorable. So here's the front view, and here's the back view, and see, it's all fold over elastic, so there was no hemming. <laughs> yeah, oh my gosh, this is so cute. Have fun making yours. Bye.